This is Recap Raps. We're running through all three Star Wars prequels today, so buckle up. Here we go. Yo, this is Recap Raps. We're running through all three Star Wars prequels today, so buckle up. Here we go. Journey to a galaxy once upon a time. To a planet in the Milky Way in 1999. Where an epic space opera that inspired generations. Got a hefty second helping full of CG animation. Start again in the stars with a Jedi beginner. Obi-Wan and his master, Qui-Gon Schindler. Two cloak wearing Jedi doing mind tricks and saber fights. Full of moral insight. But they train Vader, right? Yes, we'll get there. But for now, be patient. First deliberations and foreign relations. Negotiations, the Trade Federation, Senate delegations, and Yeah, I'm bored. Action stuff, monster fire, all the things we know in life. Weird looking monsters, based on racial archetype. Money minded Israelites, aliens from Asia, and a slapstick comedian from Lucas's Jamaica. Hello. Little Lady Chosen One couldn't be a Jedi fan. Used to be a magic thing, but now it's just a blood exam. Any interest into an adrenaline junkie sport? Deadly race that honestly was better on N64. Celebration, liberation, time to lose the cradle. But before we go, any questions? Yeah, are you an angel? It's Padme, Black Spawns, Funky little team, just a simple handmaiden. Just kidding, she's the queen. What? Now it's time for war with the cannon fodder robots. But with military strategy and discipline. Or not. Drive balls, blue balls, real hell flailing. Accidental pilot. Now this is car racing. Talking in the shadows is a scary looking Sith. Known as Dark Maul. Double sabers, man, he's cool as shit. Laser walls, awesome duel. Taking Schindler off the list. Obi Blitz, ball is split. Oh. Was it? Double like the Chancellor, even though it's quite wrong. Wipe it to a pyre to let Qui Gon be quite gone. Celebrate the victory, I'm sure it will be lifelong. All done. Mr. Wayne, cue the space fight song. Star Wars, they grew their prequels. Prequels of Star Wars, they were a thing. George, so damn annoying. Talk of this crying, now it's gonna get worse. Send in the clothes, here we go for this Oak Oscar nominee. It's half galactic mystery and half romantic comedy. Everyone looks similar to when we saw them last. But Obi has a beard now to show that time has passed. The Republic is disorderly and Pep is now a senator. Annie is a horny team desperate to get with her. It's super cute. Flirting is so memorable. Please don't look at me like that. Why not? It makes me feel uncomfortable. Moving on, Obi-Wan is on a mission. Dragging an assassin who is hunting politicians. Drake dark, missing planets, mystery unraveled more. He travels across the galaxy to basically an apple store. Like giraffe creatures who have built a clone army. So they're all the same dude, throwing shrimp on the body. We're made of one Aussie named Jango Fett. The assassin, Obi has him, but he's slippery when wet. So the love story grows with two opposites attracting. Represented by the Christians in tutorial on acting. Can you feel love? We are encouraged to love. Can you feel pain though? I'm in agony. Well, now I got to know how you feel about sand. I don't like sand. It's coarse and rough and irritating. And it gets everywhere. Okay, now to Tatooine. Mommy taking Annie on a Kanye ride. Crying scene, mommy croaks. Annie gets a murder vibe. We slaughter them like animals. That deserves sympathy. But Obi Wan needs help, so forget about your killing spree. Meanwhile, the Republic now teeters on the brink. But not because of Pal, because of Senator Binks. Uh -huh. Geo knows he's the villain. Dooku is the name. Then run and jump to Bayer Belt, ending up in chains. Escape from the monsters. Hey, what an act. The Jedi intervene, and now the clothes attack. Yeah. When you hack Jango's head, it's a brutal battle scene. It don't affect 3 PO's comedy routine. Come on. Dooku owned a Jedi. Alters Annie's physiology. Rescued just in time by Yoda's cartoon choreography. One more Oscar worthy shot to show how big the army is. Super secret wedding that's totally not ominous. Get it, everybody? Obi-Wan and Annie flying ships and getting chummy. Fight with Dooku one more time, and at the Chancellor's persuasion, Annie puts an end to Dooku with motif decapitation. Now we need a new villain. We got Grievous, because for reasons. He's mostly a droid, but he has trouble breathing. He's commanding an army with a lightsaber group on. Faces off with Obi with a captain. Let's move on. Christensen is trying hard to act with McGregor. Nothing out the door, but hey, whoop, and his preggers. Which doesn't end well, given Annie's night terrors. But they're just dreams, Annie. Is the rumor slight error? Fuck no, it's all literal. We take it super serious. So we talk about it with his father figure Sidious. He's the ones you love from dead. We like the dark side. Can I earn his power? Not from a Jedi. I have had it with these monkey fighting Sith in the Senate. And then Mace makes him age 90 years and 30 seconds. Lightning versus purple saber. Any zero hour then we knew out the window. Unlimited power. Order 66. Wipe them out. All of them. Will be one Yoda? Fine. Most of them. Any full on dark side chopping up toddlers on a murderous rampage. Oh yeah, show you this one. How controls the Senate seats. Whoa, can you get it, bro? Lightning battle. Yoda tunnels. Now he's down for Dagobah. Padme tries to change his mind, but Annie'd rather choke his wife. Type for one more saber fight, but... Rough, is lava, guys! Higher ground, Annie flies, legs slice.
Nice yellow eyes. You were the chosen one. I hate you. Nice. Warm at the ER where Pat babies the game. But not before she gives her baby's arbitrary name. Now they're reconstructing Vader back to James Earl Jones, who sums up our feelings on the prequels. Well, now that's over, gets it's all up to Disney. The future looks bright, but for now, I need a whiskey. Those were the Star Wars prequels, y'all. This is Recap Rex. Let us know in the comments what you want to see next. Pick a good one next time. Wipeout. What's up, guys? Thanks for watching. If you like this, why not check out either of these other two dope videos of ours? And be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all the latest Warp Zone content coming at you every Tuesday and Thursday. Well, I'm gonna go take a long, cold shower and think about what I just saw. I'll see you next time. Warp Zone out.